don't be anything too bad. That's an embarrassing curse. Don't you hate singing? Stop! <laughs> don't talk to me. Loser, lame old wannabe. What the? <laughs> wow, sissy, I feel sorry for you. Uh. Hey, girly, I'm new to this school. Just wanted to introduce myself. But I heard about your curse. I'm so sorry. I've got a bad feeling about you. What the actual freak was that? <laughs> <laughs> Remind me not to sit next to her at lunch. So, are you down to be official? Like, boyfriend and girlfriend? I think I like this little life. What the heck? You just ruined the moment. This was serious. I'm out of here. Baby, come back. Aw, oh, look. It's the girl who got cursed to sing. Why you gotta be so rude? Maybe try some auto-tune. <laughs> <laughs> it's the hard knock life. Hi, Chloe. I mean, oh my god. Uh, what's it? Claire. Hi, Claire. Say my name, say my name. Sorry, honey, my mind is everywhere, but you're about to get a new curse. I hope you can stop singing. Don't bring me down. Don't worry, I'm sure it's gonna be. Uh-oh. Hey, new girl, aren't you like 16? So what? Whoa, I'm just saying it's kind of weird that you have a doll. Hey, let me touch it. Back off. Jeez, she's crazy, man. Hey, what are you guys doing to my friend? Leave her alone. That doll is the last thing her parents gave her before they passed away. Dude, I bet that doll is cursed. Yeah, man, it even looks like her, too. That's some Annabelle shit right there. 20 bucks says you won't try and steal it from her. All right, bet. You're on. hey -o. Hey, give it back. <laughs> Aw, what you gonna do? This. <laughs> Detention. Over a doll? On your first day. I'm sorry, Uncle Scott, but... But nothing. You're too old for that thing now. I'm throwing it away. No! Let go. <sighs> it's for your own good. No, he ripped it. Secret file X? What is this? Secret file X? What is this? I should be able to play this on my laptop using this. Hi, honey. It's your mom here. And your dad. If you're seeing this, that means you must have kept the doll we gave you. If so, we're so proud of you because that means you might be able to fix things. We don't have much time to explain, but... It's coming. Listen, your Uncle Scott cannot be trusted, and that doll isn't a toy. It's a key to a safe. Don't... Uncle, get... The no! Come on. The doll's hand is the key to the safe. The safe is in the basement. My doll's hand unlocks a secret safe in our basement, and my Uncle Scott can't be trusted. I have to find out what's in there. Hey, kiddo, just check. What's in your hands? What's in your hands? I was writing you an apology card. Uh-huh. Let me see it. It's not finished yet. Does it look like I give a damn? Let me see it. I can't because it's a surprise. Expecting company? No, are you? No. Stay here. I have to get to the basement. Okay, I'm in the basement, but where's the safe? <sighs> That's it. The video said the doll's hand is the key to unlocking the safe. Scan hand here. Opened. It worked. Whatever's inside must be very... Valuable. I've been trying to get that safe open for years. You knew about the safe? Yeah, kid. I know about a lot of things. And one of them is that you lied to me. I'm... I'm sorry. Oh no, you're not sorry. But you're gonna be. You don't even know what your parents did for a living. Yes, I do. My mom and dad were both lawyers. <laughs> lawyers. They were spies. Spies? My parents couldn't be spies. They're not cool enough. Oh, kid. You're so innocent. Your parents were actually smarter than I thought. I'll get that doll. But right now, I'm going to get that treasure that's in this safe. Access denied. Looks like only you can get it. There's a crown in there. Now get it. Access granted. Yes, that crown is worth millions. Okay, hand it over. Wait, I want to know what really happened to my parents. Nah, kid, I don't think you really want to know the answer to that. <laughs> Veronica, open the door. Veronica, open the door! Veronica, open the door! No, not until you tell me what really happened to my parents. How did they even get this crown? I told you, your parents were spies and they acquired many riches on their missions. That crown was a gift from a princess they saved. Your parents were rich and I needed money, but they would never give it to me. So I decided to take something that they wanted 
and to never give it to them. Me. And you want to know what I did to your parents? Freeze! FBI! Whoa, hey, what's going on? Are you injured? No, but I don't understand. How did you guys know to come? Well, we've been investigating your uncle for quite some time now. Recently, we gathered enough evidence to make the arrest. I told you I'm okay. I don't need an ambulance. Honey, the ambulance isn't for you. What? While we were searching your house, we found a shed in your backyard. Did you know about the shed? Uncle Scott said it was infested with bugs. Actually, we believe we found your parents. They're in critical condition, but they're alive. Um, I can't do this anymore. I'm only 16. I, I can't handle her by myself. I have to put her up for adoption. Coming. Hi, my name is Emily. I was wondering if you wanted to buy some chocolate. Aren't you a little young to be selling stuff by yourself? Where's your mom? I, I ran away from my foster mommy. <sighs> you ran away? Oh, she's probably looking for you. Okay, here, um, come inside. All right, well, I think I better call the police. What are you looking at? That little freckle you have right there. My daughter had the same one on her face. Oh my gosh, I think you might be my kid. You're my real mommy? You know what, I shouldn't have said that out loud. I don't know that for sure, but... Please, don't make me go back to my foster mom. She's really mean. Please don't bring me back to my foster mom. Sweetheart, I... Hi, I'm looking for a little girl. She has brown hair and brown eyes, and... Please, don't let her take me. Oh my gosh, Emily. <sighs> Sorry, she runs off a lot. Oh, does she? Well, she came to my house trying to sell me some chocolates. She, she makes me sell them. Oh boy, here we go again with the stories. I'm so sorry. But, but, Emily, do you want to time out? <gasps> no, no, please. Then tell her you're sorry. I'm sorry. It's okay. All right, Emily, it's time to go. Tell her, tell her that you're my real mommy. I... Emily, we're leaving. Come visit me. My address is 2122 Maplewood. No, wait. I found her house. You know, I think she is my daughter. And I think I want her back. I am so sorry to bother you. And this is going to sound kind of crazy, but I think that Emily um, might be my daughter. And why do you think that? Well, about five years ago, I gave my daughter up for adoption. And how old is Emily? She's five. I see. And it's not just that. She also has a freckle in the same spot that my daughter had one. So you think that she's your daughter because of a freckle on <sighs> her face? Well, when you put it like that, it sounds... Look, I don't have time for this. No, please wait. I, I'm i just asking for a DNA test. I don't have the funds for that. Oh, no. I would cover all of the expenses. And if she is your daughter, do you plan on taking her back? Well, yes, I do. And what if she isn't? Then I guess I would have to leave her with you then. <sighs> Fine. I'll allow it. She did great, and we should have the results in 48 hours. Hi, is this Miss Monroe? I'm calling from the doctor's office regarding your DNA test. Wow, that was fast, and yes it is. So, according to our test, it looks like Emily is not your biological child. Are you... are you sure? Yes, ma'am. I'm so sorry. I hate to be the bearer of bad news. No, it's... it's okay. So what'd they say? Emily, I just want to tell you that I think that you're a great kid. And I am so sorry for getting your hopes up. What do you mean? Oh, I knew it. You're not a biological mother, are you? Are you? No, I'm not. No, please don't leave me here. You are my mommy. I know it. I hope you're happy with yourself. Hello? Hi, is this Miss Monroe? We're calling regarding your DNA test. Yes, it is, but you guys have already called me. No, ma'am, I think you're mistaken. We just got your results in a few hours ago. What? And it does look like Emily is your biological child. Emily, it's me. Is anyone home? This is ridiculous. Where are they? That looked like Emily in the back seat. Where is she taking her? No, listen to me. You don't understand. I am telling you that she is in danger. Again, ma'am, you don't know that for sure, and we can't do anything until she's been missing for a total of 24 hours. You know, if they're not going to help me, I'm going to find her myself. Hi, excuse me. Um, have you seen a little girl that looks like this? No, I have not. I'm sorry. Sorry. 
It's the foster mom. But where's Emily? Hey. Ah, you scared me. Good. Now where's my daughter? Good lord. Didn't we just establish that she's not your daughter? She is my daughter, and I think you and I both know that. You had someone send a fake phone call to me, didn't you? <laughs> you can't prove anything. Where is she? She's with a new foster family now. What? You gave her to a new family? She was too much for me to handle. I had to transfer her. Where? No, no. That is confidential information. You better tell me right now or I'll- Don't you dare threaten me. You're the one who gave her up in the first place. So if you want to be mad at anyone, why didn't you go look in the mirror? Why would she fake that phone call if she wanted to get rid of Emily anyways? Wait. Well, she came to my house trying to sell me some chocolates. She, she makes me sell them. I don't think that she gave her up. I think she wants to keep her and use her to make money. Let go of me. Emily, that is enough. It's time for bed. I want my real mom. She's gone. No, let go. Open up, ma'am. This is the police. The child is not on the bottom floor. Shh, guys, I heard something. <sighs> Emily, Emily? Get her to room 203. Ma'am, you cannot be in here. Please, I, I just want to know what's wrong with her. She's very dehydrated. Do you know how long she was in that closet for? No, I, I don't. This is all my fault. I should have cut to her sooner. Excuse me, your daughter is awake now. You can come and see her. Mommy. Hi, sweetheart. <laughs> What's wrong? I thought you left me. <laughs> Emily, I promise you, I am never going to leave you again, okay? No, my foster mom's going to come back. Hey, hey, it's okay. Listen, your foster mom is not coming back. I'm going to take care of you from now on. I promise? I promise. Now, you get some rest, okay, honey? Okay. Excuse me, Miss Monroe, there's a Daniel Knight here to see you. What? Mm-hmm, he's claiming to be the father of Emily. Daniel? Hey, how is she? How did you know we were here? Are you kidding? You and her are all over the news. How is she? Let me go see her. Whoa, whoa, hang on a second. You took off the day that she was born because you didn't realize how difficult raising a kid would be. Look, I, I was 16, okay? So was I, and you left me alone with her. You know, if you didn't leave, I probably wouldn't have given her up in the first place. Oh, so you're saying this is all my fault? No, that's not what I'm saying. I just don't think right now is a good time for you to see her. She's been through enough shock. Please, Allie. No, you don't get to do that. You don't get to just walk back in here and start being her parent again. Isn't that what you did? <sighs> no, that was different. How? Face it, we're in the same boat here. We both made mistakes. You had a chance to fix yours. Now it's my turn. The doctor said she's going to be okay. She just needs to sleep. Wow. She's... She's beautiful. She definitely got her looks from you. My best friend controls my bank account or my hand. Yeah, I don't need her making me go broke. She's out of town, so I wonder how this is going to work. Incoming call. Oh, it's her. Hey. Girl, I can see and hear everything you do. You can? Yeah. This is so weird. Don't worry, I won't make you do anything bad. You may now begin your test. What are you doing? I swear, I'm not trying to do this. Maya, why would you do something like that? Revenge? For what? You need to see this. What is this? A picture of you and Maya's boyfriend, and it looks like you're holding hands. What? Yeah, it's been sent out to the whole school. Maya, I swear, this isn't what it looks like. I can't believe her. I'm gonna make her week a living hell. Maya, listen, I wasn't cheating with your boyfriend. I was just... Mm. I don't want to hear her excuses. I saw the photo. They were clearly holding hands. Are you okay? Mm. No, my best friend is controlling my hand today, and she's super mad at me. Dang, it sucks to be you. <laughs> yeah, can't say I disagree. Maya, if you would just let me explain- Excuse me, you need to pay attention. I take Jim very seriously. Of course, uh, so do I, coach. Are you mocking me, Miss Missouri? No, sir. Oh, you think you're funny, huh? Go run five laps. No, but I- Uh-uh-uh, don't want to hear it. Let's go. <sighs> oh, man. Oh my gosh, I'm so thirsty. Here, you can have my water. Oh, thank you. 
Thanks again for the water. No problem. <gasps> what the? That's what you get for being a bad friend. Uh, all week you've been causing me trouble, and any time I try and explain what happened with your boyfriend, you... Mm. You do that. I don't care what you have to say anymore. I can't trust you. Oh, and I see her crush is coming near. Oh no, Nate, Maya, please, I'm begging you, don't... Hey, uh, how are you doing? Good. Great, actually. Sweet. Well, you know, prom's coming up, right? Yeah. I was wondering if you... <gasps> Nate! She just knocked out Nate! No, no, I would never. My friend is controlling my hand. Principal's office now. Listen, this is all just a big misunderstanding. Great, they put handcuffs on her. Now I can control her hand. What do you mean she's your sign language instructor? Wait, so that's why she was touching your hand? Why didn't you call me sooner? She's about to get arrested! Take her downtown. No, please wait. Stop. I was controlling her officers. She's innocent. It's what my dad would want. You picked the prince, right? Of course. Good, because I'm not having you marry a pirate. They can't be trusted. Dad was a pirate, and you married him. We don't speak of your father. You know that. Marianne, why do you have the pirate's mark? I don't know. Girl, don't lie to me. All right, fine. I picked the pirate, but I don't know why everyone is so afraid of them. They seem kind of cool. I don't think I can be friends with you. What? Why? Because I'm not going to be associated with someone who wants to marry a pirate. They're dangerous, and now that you have that mark, they're going to come for you. Mom, I'm home. Mom? <gasps> Hello. We're looking for a girl with the pirate's mark. Take off that cloak. Looking for a girl with the pirate's mark. Take off that cloak. I don't think that's... The captain wasn't asking. I knew it. I could sense her mark. Take her to the ship, boys. Yes, Captain. Wait, what? Welcome aboard the ship, the Blue Pearl. Legend says when you touch your soulmate, your mark will disappear. So let's see which one of us gets to marry you. Raise your sword if you think the girl is your soulmate. All right, make a line. Hello, miss. Let's see if it's me. Ah, but that's all of us. What about him? Father, do you think I could try? I told you to stay below deck. Ignore my son. He's no pirate. Wait, where'd you get that necklace? My father. Captain, doesn't that look just like the one that the... the pirate king had? Tell me, what is your father's name? You know what? I can already tell you're his daughter, which means you're the lost pirate princess. I can already tell you're his daughter, which means you're the lost pirate princess. My father was a pirate, but he wasn't a king. Why do you speak of him in past tense? Because he's dead. Who told you that? My mother. I see. So she was the sea witch who took you away. Don't call her that. She said she wanted to protect me from him. No. Your father wanted you to have a royal life. And she wanted you to have a normal one. At least that's what he told me. Wait a minute. You knew my father? Yes. We were great friends. Why don't I take you to him? You would do that? Of course. After all, you are royal blood. Princess, you have to get off the ship. Right now. What? Why? Because my father lied to you. He's not taking you to see your father, him, and all the other crewmates. They're cursed. The only way to break the curse is to sacrifice a royal. He wants to kill me. I want to help you, but we have to jump off the ship. Your mark, it's gone. That means I'm your... Well, soulmates. I don't even know your name. Oh, right. My name is William. I have a canoe we can escape. Not so fast. You take my son. I'll take the girl. No! William. Where are we? We're on Skull Island, princess. In the exact spot we were all cursed. How much of my blood do you need? To break the curse, we need all of it. Father, no! You stay away from my daughter. Dad? I told you he was alive. Take all of his crewmates into custody. Turn around. Wait, I was trying to help her! No, wait. Spare him, please. That's my soulmate. Gods, leave him. Yes, your majesty. Dad, I thought that you were dead. How did you find me? I gave you that necklace for a reason, Mo. It's a tracker. I see you chose to remain a princess. Well, Marianne, would you still like to marry a pirate? Yes. How would you like to be married? Air? Wait, does this mean I'm not getting superpowers? 
Hi, honey. Oh, hi. So, did you get your power? Uh... Oh, I bet you got invisibility like me. No, I bet she got my super strength. Right, sweetheart? Guys, I actually need to get to class, so I'll talk to you later, okay? Class, line up in the gym for your power assessment. <sighs> I'm so done for. Okay, state your name and your power. Sarah Steelman, and my power... Hold on. You're Steelman's kid? Yeah. It is a pleasure to meet you. I am a big fan of your parents. Bet you got an awesome power. Actually, my power hasn't exactly come in yet. <laughs> You're 18. That's impossible. I know, but it says air. That, my dear, is not normal. I'm going to send you to the nurse to have you looked at. Everything looks fine. Maybe you're just a late bloomer. Wait, it's loading again. An infinity symbol? What is that? I've mean? never seen a symbol like that. It's me. Mom? I knew you'd remember. Don't listen to her. Listen to me. Stop! That's enough. <laughs> Are you guys sure I didn't hurt you? Yes, honey, we were more worried about you. I'm fine, but... The teachers. Cal captured all of them. We have to save them. Do you know where they are? I think so. Come on. Thank you so much for saving us. Are you sure everyone's okay? We're all right, but the kids that did this to us are still out there. Wait, guys, Cal, we shouldn't have just left him knocked out. You're right. You shouldn't have. Don't look at his eyes. Sarah, I know you want to look at me. Look at me now. You want to listen. No! Say laser vision. Laser vision. <laughs> now take them out. Sarah, don't. Honey, you know us. We're your parents. You would never do this. Do it now, Sarah. No, I am done listening to you. Freeze breath. <laughs> Not so tough when you're frozen solid, now are you? Cal, Gabby, and their voice-stealing friend have all been locked up. Glad to hear that. Honey, I'm so proud of you. Well, you shouldn't be, because I'm a literal idiot. What? Sarah, why would you say that? I had a bad feeling about Cal since the beginning, but I just ignored it because I wanted a guy to like me. But of course, he was just using me the whole time. Oh, sweetheart, you're young. You're gonna make mistakes. But you're right. You should have been more careful. But what's important is that you fixed your mistake, which shows us that you're on your way to becoming a real hero. So we got you something. Surprise! My own super suit? Yep, for after you graduate. Aw, thanks, guys. Now we just gotta think of a name for you. Hmm, how about Infinity Girl? Oh, I like that! But remember, Sarah, with great power comes great responsibility. Dad, you stole that from Spider-Man. I know, but it's such a good quote. <laughs> this isn't over, Sarah. Mom! What? Where is my super suit? What? Where is my super suit? Oh, I, uh, put it away. Where? Why do you need to know? I need it. People are literally in danger right now. Your college application is in danger. It's due tomorrow and you haven't even started. Mom, I already told you I don't want to go to Super 10 University. Now if you'll excuse me. Sarah? Super speed. <laughs> Hurry up and give us the money. Not so fast. Hey, we got company. Who the hell are you? I would be Infinity Girl, and you two are about to be knocked out. Get her! Force field. I'm all out! Me too. Telekinesis. Uh, uh, oh. Hey, put us down! Okay, whatever you say. <coughs> Good, you're back. We need you to babysit. Oh, no, I can't. Yes? You need bonding time with your new baby sister. Looks like it's just you and me, Safina. <laughs> What the? She was just right here. Where did she... <laughs> How are you? <laughs> oh my gosh, are you okay? How did you even do that? People aren't supposed to get their powers until they're 18. Are you sure she did that? Yes, and she'll probably do it again. Just give her a second. Well, she's asleep right now, but I'll wake her up and... Oh no, you don't. I think you need some rest. Why don't you hand your baby sister over to me? Where are you off to? To a fire on Hero Drive. Some people might be trapped in a building. Oh, do you want us to come with you? Nah, guys, I think I'm good. My freeze breath should have that fire out in no time. Teleportation. <laughs> Look who's back. Are you okay? Yeah, I was able to save everyone, but I got a little burned in the process. Oh, honey, let me see it. Ow, Mom, what are you- Hey, Sarah. Long time no see. <laughs> Cute baby sister you got here. You put her down right now. No, I don't think I will. What did you do to me? You'll see soon enough. Mom, Dad, stop him. He's gonna take Safina. Your family is under my control. Go to sleep, Safina. Here's the teleportation device. Dad! 
Thanks, Mr. Steelman. Of course. Super strength. What? <laughs> Bye, Sarah. No. We have to find her. There's no telling what he'll do to her. We will. Sarah, are your powers working? Shapeshifting. Nope. Whatever weapon he hit me with must have taken my powers. We're going to get your powers back, but first we have to find Safina. You're right, let's go. No way. You can't come without powers. But guys, I can still fight. No, not as well as your mom and I, and I am not letting anything happen to you too. They're gonna need my help, I just know it. <coughs> Safina? <coughs> hey, kid. Hey, coach. Did you get that power yet? Yeah, I, I did. Ah, I knew you'd get it. What is it? Well, that's the thing. I don't exactly know what my power means yet, and uh, neither did the nurse. Aw, oh, kid, I hate to do this to you, but until you figure out what your power is, I'm putting you with the sidekicks. Sidekicks? No, no, my parents won't. Hey, sorry, Steelman, it's not my rule. Hey, sidekick, nice drink. Mind if I have some? Hey, Gabby, knock it off. No powers outside of class. Aw, is someone upset because they don't have a power? I do too have a power, I just don't know what it means yet. Right, you just keep telling yourself that. <sighs> I really need to find out what this symbol means. Why couldn't I have just gotten super strength or something? Hey, give me your money. Hey, I said give me your money. Get over the money. Why don't you come take it from me? Aw, that's cute. You really think you can- Oh, I think it broke my jaw. <laughs> How did I just do that? This is so weird. Wait, do I get any power I want just by saying it out loud? Okay, let's test this theory. X-ray vision. Hi, honey. We got you a gift for your 18th birthday. You guys got me a Gucci bag? Yeah. How'd you know that, sweetheart? It's in a package. Well, there's something I need to tell you. So your symbol means you have infinite powers? Yes. Coach, watch this. Think of a color. Mind reading. <laughs> You're thinking of blue. Yeah, that's amazing. Can you think of any power and then you get it? Well, I have to actually say it out loud, but yeah. Well, Stillman, I'm impressed. I'm putting you with the heroes. Yes, thank you. It's my pleasure, Stillman, but be careful. With a power like that, people are going to be very jealous. Are you sure? Yes, she's the one. We are so proud of you for getting put in the hero class. You guys have to go, huh? Yeah, sorry, sweetheart. There's a robbery three blocks down. Wait, can I come? No, honey. You can't legally fight crime until you graduate. That's right. Oh, come on. I can help you guys. I know. Just not yet. Sup, Steelman. Oh. <laughs> Whoops. Telekinesis. <laughs> oh, you little. <laughs> That's it. Come here. Freeze breath. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> You're OP, Steelman. This isn't fair. Class, open your books to page 104. We'll be learning how to outsmart a villain. Hey, mind if I share the book with you? Yeah, sure. Thanks, I'm new, so... Wait a minute, aren't you Steelman's kid? Uh, yeah. For real? Damn, your parents are so cool. So I've been told. <laughs> hey, would you, uh, want to maybe hang out sometime? You are not going on that date. Dad, honey, let her live a little. He could be a supervillain for all we know. He's not a supervillain. He's in my class. What's his name? Cal. And his last name? I didn't ask his last name. Dad, come on. You're going to make me late. Babe. Fine. But I want you back by eight. Okay, I will. Thanks. I am not going to be late to this date. Super speed. <laughs> hey. Hey. Trying out that super speed, I see. <laughs> So you're invincible, huh? Not exactly. Each power I say only lasts for 20 minutes, then I go back to normal. What would happen if you couldn't talk? What do you mean? Like if someone covered your mouth, or uh, you lost your voice. Well, then I guess I'd be stuck as normal, but why do you ask that? Oh, no, I was just wondering. Anyways, uh, you know, prom's coming up. Would you maybe want to go together? Oh, I don't think my parents would. Let you? Come on, Sarah, you're 18. Hey, maybe if I introduce myself to them, they'll be okay with it. So, Cal, tell me, what's your power? Oh, Mr. Steelman, my power is kind of lame. Oh, come on, what is it? I can glow in the dark. Wow. So you're a sidekick, huh? Dad. <laughs> it's okay. Yes, sir, I am. Actually, I like that power. It's very... Safe. I won't have to worry about you, Cal. <laughs> I think my parents kind of warmed up to you. Yeah, that was a relief. So, I'll pick you up at 8 for prom then? Okay, yeah. You look beautiful, sweetheart. 
gorgeous. Oh, thanks, guys. But we want you to take this. Here. A uh, bracelet? Emergency locator. If anything goes wrong, you press that and we'll be there. <sighs> thanks. Ready to go? Yeah, I think... Wait, I forgot my purse. Hold on, let me go super speed up there and then I'll go... No! Don't use your powers right now, okay? Excuse me? Why don't you want me using my powers? I just thought that we could be normal for a little bit, but I'm so sorry. I shouldn't have yelled at you like that. Go ahead and get your purse. It's okay. I, I don't even need my purse, actually. Let's just go. I'm gonna go get us some punch. Oh, okay. Sarah, have you seen the teachers? No, why? They're supposed to be here, but I can't find any of them. They're probably just running late. Sarah, come here. I want to show you something. Wait, where are we going? I want to take you somewhere private. Oh. Wait, did you hear that? No, what? Never mind. Come on, I know a nice spot for us. Are you cold? Maybe just a little bit. Aw, uh, here, take my jacket. Oh, actually, no need. Flame hands. <laughs> Sarah, baby, remember I told you not to use your powers? Sorry, I just thought that- Shh. Do you remember what I told you my power was? Yeah, you said you had the power to glow in the dark. <laughs> I lied. You lied to me about your power? Of course. Did you really think I was a sidekick? Well, yeah. Wow, you are so gullible. That's it. I'm getting my parents. <laughs> are you looking for this? <laughs> Hi, Sarah. Hey, babe. Babe, you two are dating? Gabby, do it now. With pleasure. Mm. I can't hold her like that for mm. long. Where's your friend, Gabby? She's supposed to be here. Mm. <sighs> Relax, I'm here. Cal, what is going on? Do it! Super! That's your voice. Don't try to talk, Sarah. Just look at me. Nighty night, Sarah. <laughs> oh good, you're awake. Don't be scared, Sarah. It's just a mask. It's me, Cal. Now it's time for me to get revenge on your parents. Give her her voice back. She's ready. First you're going to eliminate your parents, then all the teachers. Hey, Mom. Hey, Dad. You're back early. Where's Cal? Oh, he's right there. Hey, Mr. Steelman. Cal, what's going on? I'm getting my revenge. Don't you recognize this mask? It was my father's before you killed him. Now, Sarah, tell him what you're going to do. I'm going to eliminate both of you. Honey, he must have mind-controlled her. Telekinesis. <laughs> Sarah, put that down. <sighs> Sarah, stop it. She only listens to me now. Oh, Mom. Where'd you go? Sarah, listen to me. You are stronger than this. Teleportation. Wait! Mom, where are you? I thought I heard you over here. Flame him. There's no sense in hiding. Found you. <laughs> Just show yourself and this all can stop. Listen to me. You know me. I got my color. Wait, don't tell me until I get mine, okay? Okay. Color placement. Scanning. Color place. Okay. I'll tell you what I got, and then you tell me what you got. Got different colors? Yeah. What do you think they mean? To overpopulation, reds must eliminate blues. Starting tomorrow. Yeah, I did. Well, I have an idea on how to save you. We can try. I don't see why not. Okay, I'm gonna try it. No, I. I actually kind of got scared for a little bit. I know you really need the money. Brie, are you kidding? I got my color. Wait, don't tell me until I get mine, okay? Okay. Replacement. Scanning. Color place. Okay. I'll tell you what I got, and then you tell me what you got. Got different colors? Yeah. What do you think they mean? To overpopulation, reds must eliminate blues. Starting tomorrow. Yeah, I did. Well, I have an idea on how to save you. We can try. I don't see why not. Okay, I'm gonna try it. No, I... I actually kind of got scared for a little bit. I know you really need the money. Brie, are you kidding? I got my color. Wait, don't tell me until I get mine, okay? Okay. Replacement. Scanning. Color place. Okay. I'll tell you what I got, and then you tell me what you got. Got different colors? Yeah. What do you think they mean? To overpopulation, reds must eliminate blues. Starting tomorrow. Yeah, I did. Well, I have an idea on how to save you. We can try. I don't see why not. Okay, I'm gonna try it. No, I... I actually kind of got scared for a little bit. I know you really need the money. Brie, are you kidding? I got my color. Wait, don't tell me until I get mine, okay? Okay. 
Color placement. Scanning. Color placement. Okay, I'll tell you what I got, and then you tell me what you got. You got different colors? Yeah. What do you think they mean? To overpopulation, reds must eliminate blues. Starting tomorrow. Yeah, I did. Well, I have an idea on how to save you. We can try. I don't see why not. Okay, I'm gonna try it. You know, I, I actually kind of got scared for a little bit. I know you really need the money. Brie, are you kidding? I got my color. Wait, don't tell me until I get mine, okay? Okay. Color placement. Scanning. Color placement. Okay, I'll tell you what I got, and then you tell me what you got. You got different colors? Yeah. What do you think they mean? To overpopulation, reds must eliminate blues. Starting tomorrow. Yeah, I did. Well, I have an idea on how to save you. We can try. I don't see why not. Okay, I'm gonna try it. You know, I, I actually kind of got scared for a little bit. I know you really need the money. Brie, are you kidding? I got my color. Wait, don't tell me until I get mine, okay? Okay. Replacement. Scanning. Color placement. I'll tell you what I got, and then you tell me what you got. You got different colors? Yeah. What do you think they mean? To overpopulation, reds must eliminate blues. Starting tomorrow. Yeah, I did. Well, I have an idea on how to save you. We can try. I don't see why not. Okay, I'm gonna try it. You know, I, I actually kind of got scared for a little bit. I know you really need the money. Brie, are you kidding? I got my color. Wait, don't tell me until I get mine, okay? Okay. Replacement. Scanning. Color place. Okay. I'll tell you what I got, and then you tell me what you got. You got different colors? Yeah. What do you think they mean? To overpopulation, reds must eliminate blues. Starting tomorrow. Yeah, I did. Well, I have an idea on how to save you. We can try. I don't see why not. Okay, I'm gonna try it. You know, I, I actually kind of got scared for a little bit. I know you really need the money. Brie, are you kidding? I got my color. Wait, don't tell me until I get mine, okay? Okay. Replacement. Scanning. Color placement. Okay. I'll tell you what I got, and then you tell me what you got. You got different colors? Yeah. What do you think they mean? To overpopulation, reds must eliminate blues. Starting tomorrow. Yeah, I did. Well, I have an idea on how to save you. We can try. I don't see why not. Okay, I'm gonna try it. You know, I... I actually kind of got scared for a little bit. I know you really need the money. Brie, are you kidding? I got my color. Wait, don't tell me until I get mine, okay? Okay. Replacement. Scanning. Color place. Okay. I'll tell you what I got, and then you tell me what you got. You got different colors? Yeah. What do you think they mean? To overpopulation, reds must eliminate blues. Starting tomorrow. Yeah, I did. Well, I have an idea on how to save you. We can try. I don't see why not. Okay, I'm gonna try it. You know, I, I actually kind of got scared for a little bit. I know you really need the money. Brie, are you kidding? I got my color. Wait, don't tell me until I get mine, okay? Okay. Replacement. Scanning. Color place. Okay. I'll tell you what I got, and then you tell me what you got. You got different colors? Yeah. What do you think they mean? To overpopulation, reds must eliminate blues. Starting tomorrow. Yeah, I did. Well, I have an idea on how to save you. We can try. I don't see why not. Okay, I'm gonna try it. You know, I, I actually kind of got scared for a little bit. I know you really need the money. Brie, are you kidding? I got my color. Wait, don't tell me until I get mine, okay? Okay. Replacement. Scanning. Color place. I'll tell you what I got, and then you tell me what you got. You got different colors? Yeah. What do you think they mean? To overpopulation, reds must eliminate blues. Starting tomorrow. Yeah, I did. Well, I have an idea on how to save you. We can try. I don't see why not. Okay, I'm gonna try it. You know, I, I actually kind of got scared for a little bit. I know you really need the money. Brie, are you kidding? I got my color. Wait, don't tell me until I get mine, okay? Okay. Replacement. Scanning. Color place. Okay. I'll tell you what I got, and then you tell me what you got. You got different colors? Yeah. What do you think they mean? To overpopulation, reds must eliminate blues. Starting tomorrow. Yeah, I did. Well, I have an idea on how to save you.
We can try. I don't see why not. Okay, I'm gonna try it. You know, I, I actually kind of got scared for a little bit. I know you really need the money. Brie, are you kidding? I got my color. Wait, don't tell me until I get mine, okay? Okay. Replacement. Scanning. Color play. Okay, I'll tell you what I got, and then you tell me what you got. Got different colors? Yeah. What do you think they mean? To overpopulation, reds must eliminate blues starting tomorrow. Yeah, I did. Well, I have an idea on how to save you. We can tr I don't see why not. Okay, I'm gonna try it. You know, I, I actually kind of got scared for a little bit. I know you really need the money. Brie, are you kidding? I got my color. Wait, don't tell me until I get mine, okay? Okay. Replacement. Scanning. Color play. I'll tell you what I got, and then you tell me what you got. Got different colors? Yeah. What do you think they mean? To overpopulation, reds must eliminate blues, starting tomorrow. Yeah, I did. Well, I have an idea on how to save you. We can try. I don't see why not. Okay, I'm gonna try it. You know, I, I actually kind of got scared for a little bit. I know you really need the money. Brie, are you kidding? I got my color. Wait, don't tell me until I get mine, okay? Okay. Replacement. Scanning. Color play. Okay. I'll tell you what I got, and then you tell me what you got. Got different colors? Yeah. What do you think they mean? To overpopulation, reds must eliminate blues, starting tomorrow. Yeah, I did. Well, I have an idea on how to save you. We can tr- I don't see why not. Okay, I'm gonna try it. You know, I- I actually kind of got scared for a little bit. I know you really need the money. Brie, are you kidding? I got my color. Wait, don't tell me until I get mine, okay? Okay. Replacement. Scanning. Color play. Okay. I'll tell you what I got, and then you tell me what you got. Got different colors? Yeah. What do you think they mean? To overpopulation, reds must eliminate blues, starting tomorrow. Yeah, I did. Well, I have an idea on how to save you. We can tr- I don't see why not. Okay, I'm gonna try it. You know, I- I actually kind of got scared for a little bit. I know you really need the money. Brie, are you kidding? I got my color. Wait, don't tell me until I get mine, okay? Okay. Replacement. Scanning. Color play. Okay. I'll tell you what I got, and then you tell me what you got. Got different colors? Yeah. What do you think they mean? To overpopulation, reds must eliminate blues, starting tomorrow. Yeah, I did. Well, I have an idea on how to save you. We can tr- I don't see why not. Okay, I'm gonna try it. You know, I- I actually kind of got scared for a little bit. I know you really need the money. Brie, are you kidding? I got my color. Wait, don't tell me until I get mine, okay? Okay. Replacement. Scanning. Color play- Okay. I'll tell you what I got, and then you tell me what you got. Got different colors? Yeah. What do you think they mean? To overpopulation, reds must eliminate blues, starting tomorrow. Yeah, I did. Well, I have an idea on how to save you. We can tr- I don't see why not. Okay, I'm gonna try it. You know, I- I actually kind of got scared for a little bit. I know you really need the money. Brie, are you kidding? Speak a language to speak until you meet your soulmate? English or Spanish? I mean, everyone I know speaks English, so... Surprise attack! ¿Qué te pasa? <laughs> Why are you speaking Spanish? Esto es su culpa. Oh, you must have been picking what language to speak today. Mamá, tenemos un problema. Honey, did you pick to speak Spanish until you kiss your soulmate? How did this happen? Well... Ella. It was an accident. I'm sorry. Aw, oh, it's okay, baby. Seriamente? Oh, stop. You'll be fine. Go to school. Don't worry, bestie. I speak Spanish. I can translate for you. Sé sí que... Gracias. Hey, girly, I gotta do something. I'll be right back. Just wait here. Por favor, ayúdame. Duele la cabeza. Sorry, girl, I don't speak Spanish. Por favor, ayúdame. Duele la cabeza. Are you speaking Spanish, girly? I'm sorry, I don't understand. Hey, I couldn't help but hear you said your head was hurting. Sí, ¿puedes entenderme? Sí, hablo español. I can understand you. Follow me. You said you need your medication. Where's your backpack? I... Okay. ¿Te sientes mejor? Did the medication help? Sí, gracias. 
So you can't speak English at all right now? And you won't be able to until you kiss your soulmate? You never know, maybe you and I are soulmates. <laughs> I'm just saying, maybe we should try to... Well, that was nice. Sorry if I'm being awkward. No, it's okay. No way, you just spoke English. You and I must be soulmates. Soulmate.